Good to see you. So you're finishing up your Hello. spring cleaning and you're not sure it? what to do with the stuff that you were ready to toss out or how to freshen up the things that you're keeping? Coming to the rescue are four experts this morning. We're beginning with Tom Felicia. He is a celebrity interior designer and also author of Tom Felicia Style. Good morning. Good morning. So how are you? So you're here to help us spring yeah. clean our furniture. What do we have to remember? <laughs> spring cleaning and interior design is really all about editing. Editing is sort of the key uh, component. It's all about editing your furniture and your accessories, cleaning house, lightening the load. It's kind of the same thing you do with your, you know, with your clothing. With everything else. Right, exactly. So let's say you have a piece of furniture that you really don't want to throw out. Some <laughs> options. Can you give it to charity and how would you go about that? Absolutely. Um, you can give it to charity. There's, there's great charities that you can get involved with. Uh, there's the National Furniture Bank Association, which is a great one. They're national, they're, so they're, anyone can, uh, can contact them. Um, there's Habitat for Humanity. That's another great organization. Are there basic rules? Does your furniture have to be in good condition? You're, absolutely. You know, you don't want to give furniture to a charity that is, you know, that it's that that needs to go to furniture heaven. You want you want you want to give them pieces that still have another life in them. And so, not dirty, right? And they not don't dirty. Have the money to clean. Right. If, if furniture, right? If it has springs coming on, if it hurts to sit on, or if you sneeze when you get near it, then you shouldn't give it to charity. <laughs> Good rule of thumb. <laughs> what about Tom? If you want to resell it, how should you well, go about Well, you know, that? absolutely. If you want to resell your furniture, there, are, you know, there's of course there's eBay, but there's also, you know, there's there's uh, there's so many other. Um, you can go online and find other groups that that are great to work with as well in terms of you know, selling your furniture, there's apartmenttherapy.com, uh, mm -hmm. uh, at the classifieds, there's Backpage, which is another great group to work with. Um, Any so, one tip to keep in mind if someone is considering reselling? Um, you know, take great photographs of it, give a great description of it, and also uh, be very clear about its condition. Okay. Last you know? seconds, how can we spruce up something we've got at home? Easy, inexpensive way to spruce up your bedroom or your living room that's, you know, slip covers are not just for your furniture. Pillows. You can have a great winter uh, pillow in a velvet and then simply just a pillow cover, zip it right over, and you have a new fresh look for the summer. Look at Same what a difference. Here. And you can see how you can take this color and bring it into this and have a simple cotton. You know, you go from a velvet to a simple cotton with a great fun summer yeah. print. Makes you feel like you're in a whole exactly. new room. Thank you so much. Great. Thanks. Good to Thank have you, you Tom Felicia.